Hey everyone, it's Cashew. Time for another installment of Fiery Fridays where I review hot sauces and I occasionally sprinkle in spicy snacks and food that packs the heat. This week, I'm really excited to share with you Bravado Spice Company's Pineapple and Habanero Hot Sauce. And this five ounce bottle cost me, I believe, $6.99. It's a medium heat. It's uh, three out of five chilies and 100% vegan and gluten free. So let me read the ingredients to you. They consist of pineapple, white wine vinegar, yellow bell pepper, habanero, garlic, and sea salt. So there's not a whole lot of, of stuff in here. And best of all, no xanthan gum. And because I'm not really a big fan of xanthan gum. And according to their website, you do not have to refrigerate this. And but they do recommend you refrigerate their sauces to keep them fresh. But if you wanted to take one of their sauces with you when you go out with friends for dinner and have them sample it with their meal or you just you know want to have it with you you could take it with you and undeniably bold a blend of delicious pineapple and fiery habanero this sweet and spicy sauce is the ultimate crowd pleaser sometimes nature hands you an ace in the hole we'll see and for those of you who are concerned with the nutritional facts there are 28 one teaspoon servings in this bottle, zero, zero calories, and 20 milligrams of sodium, so that's not too bad, and less than one gram of total carbohydrate, and no grams of sugar. So that's interesting since there's pineapple in it. And look at this color. I mean, this is beautiful. And I'm sure it's the combination of the yellow bell pepper and pineapple, maybe even the habanero, and it has such a nice, rich color. I mean, this is beautiful. And uh, I already took off the, the shrink wrap band around the top. Uh, this is, I forget how many times I've tried filming this because the, the top was pretty tough to cut off. So I went ahead and cut it off already. So let's see. Oh, this is nice. I don't smell the pineapple that much, but I do smell initially the, the habanero. Oh, wait a minute. Now I, now I smell the pineapple. My initial, my initial uh, reaction was to the habanero, but if you get a really deep breath of this, this is, um, it smells like pineapple juice in the morning. Mm, this is, this smells great. I mean, really just smells wonderful and <clears throat> I would probably put this on Asian dishes like Thai Thai food uh, Japanese food really pretty much any kind of Asian dish and of course I would put it on my ice cream and cheesecake so I think this would be a pretty versatile uh, sauce now keep in mind I mean, just because I suggest some of the things you can put on, you might like it on something else that I wouldn't. So you might like it on steak or on a uh, pulled pork sandwich, and I wouldn't. But, you know, experiment. Life's short, and sauce it up. So let me uh, see how it tastes on this uh, mother of pearl caviar spoon. Ooh, it's, it's pretty liquidy. It's pretty thin, and looks nice. So let's try it out. It tastes a little thin, but it has great flavor. The initial flavor that I got was pineapple, and then very short after that, uh, the habanero kicked in, and it has a very spicy habanero finish on the back of my throat. I'll try this again. Oh yeah, that's that's really good. And I would say probably on the heat scale, mm, two, three, maybe a two between a two and a three. If you're sensitive to spicy foods, maybe a five. But yeah, this is this is definitely a, a manageable heat if you're not really into a lot of hot stuff and. 
Let's see how it tastes on a, on a chip. That actually tastes really good on a chip. I didn't think it would with the pineapple on it, but it actually, it works. And I think the reason it does is because it's got that yellow bell pepper and, and the habanero in it. So let's try some more. This is a well-balanced sauce. I mean, it really is. They did a splendid job of, of balancing that pineapple with the habanero. And I mean, this is good. This is something that um, I would definitely keep in my fridge at all times. And, and really any of the Bravado Spice Company's hot sauces, they do just excellent work. And I'll put a link to their uh, website in the description box down below in case you want to order some sauces from them and I mean this is this is really good and the pineapple isn't overpowering by any means because I was afraid it's gonna be a little too sweet and uh, it really isn't I think the habanero really uh, balances out and has just a nice uh, um, bite to it just enough to uh, really enjoy what you're uh, what you're gonna eat this with so uh, Definitely get this. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. <clears throat> Be sure to like, subscribe, ring the notification bell. And in the description box down below, I'll have links to my PayPal, my Patreon, and my Teespring if you'd like to help support this channel. And until next time, everyone, this is Cashew signing off.